Hi friends, it's Miss Chelsea, and I'm going to show you all of the um, centers in the G kit this week. So this one, we're going to take these little circles and we're going to fill in the G. So I'm going to take my glue stick and fill it all in. And then take some circles, put them on the glue. And you can put as many as you want. That's my G. And I'm going to do the same thing to the lowercase one. And then on the other side, it's practice writing. So the top row is uppercase, the bottom is lowercase, and that's one of our G centers this week. Another center is our gumball puzzle. So it's going to look like this. Some of you guys are going to have higher numbers and some friends are going to have lower numbers. So this has 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So I'm going to put them in order, spread them out, and you can glue them if you want or you can just keep them cut up so you can do it again. So I'm going to take 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, line it all up, and then I have my gumball machine. That is another center for G. in our younger friends kit and we have an uppercase G and a lowercase G and at the bottom of your page I already cut them out there's going to be uppercases and lowercases so you're going to take your glue stick or you can just place them on and you're going to sort your uppercase and lowercase so I have my uppercase and I put it in the uppercase circle and my lowercases go in the lowercase so again you can either glue them or just place them on and sort through your uppercase and lowercase letters. Okay, that's for my younger friends. My older friends have this sheet. It's called Beginning Sound Match. So again, at the bottom, there's pictures and I already cut some of them out. So I have a dog, a frog, an elephant, a grape, and I'm gonna find a letter that matches. So, F for frog. Frog. So you can either glue it on or place it on. Same with the D for the dog. Where would the E go? And the G. Okay? So that's for my older friends. Then, we have these fun activities for counting. Okay? So, some friends have higher numbers, some friends have lower numbers. Mine is seven, so it comes with feathers. And I'm going to put glue all over my goose, and I'm gonna count seven feathers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Some friends will have higher numbers, okay? You're gonna glue it on to the goose, and then you're gonna do the same thing for the baby geese, okay? So there's 15 and 10, so you would glue that amount of feathers on. So those are our G projects for our kit this week.